Yo, hello YouTube, what is happening? Uh, my name's Ravi, I'm going to do a really quick unboxing of my GoPro Hero 4 Session. Um, I don't normally do these kinds of videos, but I figured, you know what? I watched a lot of these videos when I was about to buy my camera, and they helped me a lot. So I thought, why not throw out my own one, just see if it helps someone else. So, boom, I got a brand new package this morning from Amazon. It is my GoPro Hero 4 Session. Voila. Here we have it straight out of the box from Amazon. And I'm going to tell you simply why I chose this one. So I did a lot of looking into, I did a lot of research into my cameras. I was going to buy a new GoPro because it's about time I bought one. I've been rocking the GoPro Hero 3 for long enough now. And uh, yeah, battery life is really starting to die. So time for a new one. Debated whether getting the Hero 5, the Hero 5 session, the Hero 4 session. Basically, it all comes down to what I'm actually going to use it for, which is a lot of on-the-go kind of videos, very quick stop-and-shoot kind of stuff. So, pretty much, I looked into it, and it came down to the price. At the end of the day, the GoPro Hero 4 I bought off Amazon for £149, which is like... Um, almost half the price of the Hero 5 session, which is still at, I think, 289 or something like that, I saw it. And of course, if you're gonna spend three, almost 300 pound on a GoPro session, you might as well spend like an extra 20 quid and get the full, full fully fledged Hero 5. Um, anyway, this is my GoPro Hero 4 session. Let's get it out of the box. Well, I just broke the box. <laughs> That's me, my attempt at making some background music so you guys don't get bored while I do that. Taking off the bottom, taking out this stuff. How the? Well, you know what? I should have watched an unboxing for this before, shouldn't I? Tell me how to actually take it out of the box. Oh, there we go. That's better. Fine. So. Funky glass case. Boom, Hero 4 session looks just like this. I'm gonna take this off here. Let's unclip that one. Lift that up. Unclip it forward. Boom, there you go. Hero 4 session looks like that. Inside the box, we have some stuff. Let's throw the stuff on the table. And is there any more stuff in here? No, no more stuff in here. So simple as it comes. GoPro Hero for Session from Amazon, 149 pounds. Manual, couple little sticky pads, cable, very important, and voila, the GoPro Hero 4 Session with mount. Um, that's pretty much it. I hope this video helped somebody. Um, like I said, I watched tons of these videos before I made my decision, before I bought mine, and they helped. So I just thought I'd throw this out there show off to you guys so boom almost half the price of the hero 5 session but uh yeah the differences will be things like the voice activation i'm never going to use a voice activation for especially for the types of videos i shoot i shoot a lot of action videos so voice activation just it's just going to be more difficult than than not and what else and then shooting in 4k um, shooting in 4K is great, but to be honest, I do all my video editing on my MacBook Pro and 4K video just won't, uh, it won't support 4K video, it won't hold. If I try and run 4K video, edit, for, sorry, if I try and edit 4K video on a laptop, it's just going to crash my laptop. So, 4K video is fantastic. If you've got a home studio, home suite, and you do a lot of stuff like that, then boom tings, brilliant. But for me, I'm just a little average Joe. I want to make really cool videos. I want to make them quick. I want to have this as portable as possible. Boom, that's it. Um, anything else I can think of, I will call you and tell you on your mobile. That's it for now. Adios.